We discussed some videos ago just how comfortable Isabel is amongst the bananas. She has been quoted as saying, the more bananas, the merrier. And good on her for admitting it. G'day everyone and welcome to Super T Console Gaming. It is Mario Kart 8 Deluxe and it is Animal Crossing vs Mario Kart with our little friend Isabel taking on the Rock Cup as we head off to the London Loop. Welcome, thank you so much for joining us. I hope you're all awesome. Get in the comments, say hello. If you're enjoying a nice coffee, well done to you. Let me know what sort it is because I'm interested. I want to know these things. Anyway, Isabel going for four wins out of four races. Can she do it? London will be our first challenge in the Rock Cup. Let's get stuck straight into it. And as is the want to do, we'll start from the back of the grid in race one and do our best to get up. First, we overtake a couple of them. There's a few big boys in this one. They might bash us around a bit. Isabel's trying to get past Boo. And he says, nah, you can have all of this red shell which wasn't particularly nice, although we did manage to avoid Toadette's banana, I believe that was, and it sounds like an oxymoron, but believe me when I say she had a banana. Hey, boo, have that one. That one can go up the road. We'll try and dodge these flames. Toadette, you nuisance. Villager and Toadette, what an unlikely combination. Oh, I wanted that. Oh, I didn't get it. The double box has eluded me. What have I got for funsies? It's the rotating bananas. We discussed some videos ago just how comfortable Isabel is amongst the bananas. She has been quoted as saying, the more bananas, the merrier. And good on her for admitting it. Not too many people would be game to say that. All right, there's going to be a dodgy random banana come our way, and of course it manages to get through what is normally an impenetrable defence. Thank you very much for everyone there, just wasting my time. Round we go. Oh, I can't... I was going to say, I, I can't waste a green shell by throwing it at her, because I'll definitely miss. But what we will do, we'll sneak around this corner and just try and rub it across the bridge of her nose. Oh, and we did just that. Well done. I thought she was going to do the same to me with the banana, but we dodged it. Because again, Isabel, she knows how to dodge a banana. She feels comfortable amongst them and dodges them when she wants to. And I think that's the sign of a true professional. <laughs> uh, idiot. That's me giving myself a rap. Idiot. <laughs> anyway, boo. Hasn't come out and taken any items off us yet, so I'm sure that's going to happen shortly. Chain shops are in the River Thames. Oh, green shells. Honestly, you guys terrify me, the whole lot of you. Actually, let's... Oh, squid. Oh, I didn't get any of those coins. You buffed. Bridge goes up just as I get off it. Oh, no! I missed the turn. <laughs> uh, you need to play this game more often. Apparently once a day isn't enough. Anyway, still lap three and we still have the banana out the back. I think we're gonna get away with what was a fairly straightforward win. We didn't come through by a big margin, but no one really sort of upset us, which is good to see. And again, look at the flowers just pouring out of her. Let's get on to race number two and see if we can crack this GP wide open. With two wins from two, that would be the ideal situation for Isabel early on. In the Rock Cup, she's doing good. A massive fan of her. And here she is in Boo Lake. I hope she can breathe underwater because we're going to spend a fair bit of time down there, I can tell you. I'd say I'd give you the tip, but really and honestly, there's no difference. Whether it's the tip or the whole thing, it's just you've either done it or you haven't. You can't make a call. There's no spectrum on that sort of thing. Anyway, we're off. Bad start, but Boo's out in front leading the way. Um, we'll stay away from him so he doesn't knock us into the water. I'll swallow that coin and then head up to head back down again. Under we go for the bony fish. 
They're down here somewhere. There they are. Oh, I've bounced off a wall. What am I doing? Now I'm nervous because we've got green shells everywhere. Why do people throw them? They're dangerous. Luigi's Mansion up on the hill looking amazing as always. Hey. Okay, let's get around the outside of that banana. Jeez, they've peppered the course with bananas, haven't they? Where did they all come from? All right, let's try and get this turn right this time. And we've done just that. Uh, surely, surely the water's going to wash away the squid ink. Come on. Doesn't matter, she says. I can still drive like a superhero. Isabel, lap three is yours. Let's go. The first red shell has been thrown. Oh, no. I've made a mistake and the game will punish me for that. Here we go. Anybody else, it says. Oh, really? I've made this infinitely complex for myself. Am I going to get away with it? Let's find out. We've got a double box, but we are close to the end. Okay, banana's out. We should be okay. I tell you what, that got a bit touch and go there. We've got away with the win. Lakitu tried to show up in the late stages and cause us problems, but in the end, even he was overrun by King Boo and Villager. Well done to you, Isabel. Champion as always. Race number three, let's get stuck into it. The screen of awkwardness, of course, always making an appearance with those wonderful little silhouettes doing their best to make lighting screens interesting. I'll tell you what, I'm playing a lot of One Piece Pirate Warriors 4 at the moment, and the loading screens in that game are absolutely atrocious. <laughs> like, I, I actually edit them out there that long. It's insane. Some of them can be like two or three minutes. You're just sitting there going, are we going to play now? Are we going to play now? All right, let's go. Race three. This can be some good fun. And I've missed the start. Can you believe it? It was like I was talking too much. Who would have thought that would be a problem in my world? Anyway, Villager is the one to beat, as always, as we head up into the cave. Hopefully the bats stay out of my way. They've done that. Let's just try and shorten the old girl up, throw a red, and hit her in the face with it, hopefully. For our troubles, we got a coin and a green one. I'll hold the green out the back and make our way through the back roads. I made a beeline for the double box then, realising there was no need to do that. <laughs> As Boo rocks up to take everything off me. Well done, mate, you're a legend. Um, and by legend, I mean I dislike you a whole bunch. Oh, wow. Missed the jump, but that's... Oh, hang on. Are you guys... Are you right? Like, how much more pain and suffering did you want to cause Isabel on lap number one? Let's go again. Bats are plenty. We dodge them nicely. There's a banana on the track, which, you know, someone's not doing their job. They should be cleaned up. They should be a flag out so the stewards can tend to that scenario. All right, let's go again. It's the old... It's the same thing every time. It's a coin and a banana, or it's a coin and a green shell. Give me something fun. You know, let me dominate from the front. Don't make me fall back to get good items. Now, this section of track last time ruined me. Let's try and get it right. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Nah, missed the jump again. We'll flick through the sign. Oh, there we go. Nice. I do get a bit nervous whenever I try and get clever there. And to be honest, I'm not getting that clever, but still, I get nervous. With the final lap upon us, let's get cracking. We've already had one blue shell in this game. Um, surely they wouldn't be dodgy enough to throw a second one at us. We will make our way for a second double box there. Hopefully it'll help us uh, as I throw one of my bananas away. You idiot. Jeez, we like to get close. 
And there we have it, everybody. Isabel gets the win again. She can't be beaten. She knows where it's at. And that sets her up for a showdown with race number four, where she will indeed be going for a clean sweep. King Boo and Villager chasing hard. Lakitu holding strong in fourth. And then it's Daylight back to Toadette and the other mob. We won't worry about them. They're too far back to even consider. Come on, four from four. Let's do it. I know she can. She's proven it in the last couple of videos, which has been great. But there was an anomaly there where I think two Grand Prix in a row. We, um, we got absolutely towed up. We still got the gold cup, but I'll tell you what, there was some, I think one cup we put on a terrible race and then another cup we did two terrible races. It's the Maple Treeway that stands between Isabel and a, and a clean sweep in this one. Let's see what we can do here. Lakitu, come on, mate. Let's let's do it. She's off. King Boo again. Okay. We are set for the ascent. Oh, three mushies. Now, I must say that we we got two free mushies through there and we still cannot get in front of Boo. He's racing like some kind of super ghost. Let's peel off down to the right side here. Well, he has maintained that lead throughout the entire lap there. We need to do something to rectify it on oh, the lightning. The lightning. Oh, green shells. It all comes at once, and I just feel nervous the whole way up this hill now. That nearly got very hairy through there, but we managed to make it. Great cornering there, Isabel. I've got to stop trying to get the jump there because I never get it. And I literally cause myself more problems than it's worth. And I refuse to acknowledge that I won't make the jump ever. Hey, free mushies. <laughs> you know what? That was just a stitch up of mammoth proportions. Typical Mario Kart, if ever there was a typical Mario Kart. Hey, nah, missed it. Got him, yes. So learn from your mistakes. There we go. We did it. Oh, well, we're just going to sail on in here. I don't think they can do anything to hurt us. I'll even pick up a free mushy on the way through. And that is a clean sweep for Isabel in the Rock Cup. She's gone four from four. Well done to her. And with that, it's time to head off and have a look at the highlights package. What will Mario Kart TV serve up for us? Highlights, lowlights, or just random footage? Who knows? But we'll soon find out. They've got a full four tracks to choose from, so it'll be interesting to see which one it picks. I'm hoping Boo Lake. I feel like a bit of Boo Lake action would be nice. What are we going to get? Here we go. Oh, it's London Loop. We've gone back to the start, and apparently it's all about... Me getting beaten up. <laughs> you kinda, you kinda didn't show us some of those highlights. If I'm honest, you, you give us the setup and then skip the punchline. <laughs> uh, dearie me. Anyway, there you have it, everybody. First, 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 and first. 
the little furry one has done it well done to her and well done to you as always for hanging out with us thanks very much for doing that in the comments let us know what you thought like the video subscribe to the channel and we'll see you legends next time Hooroo. see you later have fun bye now